Medical research touches every aspect of our lives, from the moment we're born to the moment we die. I wish I could tell you that all the research is being done in a noble search for truth by completely rational scientists, but the truth is, some medical research is hardly worth the paper it's printed on. But that doesn't stop the media from using studies to inflame, frighten, or give false hope to those suffering from disease. From there, articles are posted, linked, liked, shared, and otherwise passed on via all manner of social media, leading to rapid dissemination of bad science. I know this because I'm a physician and a medical researcher. I've got grants from the National Institutes of Health and the Department of Defense. I trained at Harvard, Columbia, the University of Pennsylvania, and now I'm a faculty member here at Yale. I'm an insider. I want you to become one too. There were 1,250,000 medical studies published last year. In that group are some that will change history, cure disease, improve quality of life, and become the anchors for future discovery. But there are some that will harm you or those you love. Join me as I give you the tools to figure out which studies hold the promise for the future. I'll lay bare how money, prestige, and wishful thinking influence researchers in ways that don't help patients. In the end, you'll understand in a way you never have before how medical research works, what research is trustworthy, and of course, when your Facebook friend is wrong.